So I'm literally on edge tonight. I don't know whether it's because the dog didn't take... I don't think the dog took even five minutes before it ran away. And I think when I received a message at around 10, 15 or 10, 20 or something. Um, I think that... I think that's when the other person had found out that, that maybe the dog was at someone else's house. Um, but literally, like, I don't think she took 10 minutes to run away. I don't know where she went. I was treating her to lots of attention. She was being so good. And then at the end of the night, I let her out. I'm like, oh, it's getting close to 1030. But it's like, I don't go to bed for another hour and a half. I'm not like the other person who goes to bed at, at 10.30. And I'm like, all right, well, I guess I can let you out. All you do is lay in the cement after going for a walk. And I was like, okay. But just everything about tonight has given me the creeps. Maybe I'm nervous for, for, uh, for the pet that's gone missing, but... Everything about the outdoors tonight just rattles me, and I'm, like, scared. I literally am, like, shaking in under my skin. Uh, I feel like, yeah, and like I said, I might just be nervous for the dog because, I mean, running away in the middle of the night is no good. Um, but, um... You know, my imagination can grow wild what the things she might be able to get up to. But I'm, I'm just scared. Like, I'm scared. So if I, hopefully, um, I will find a hole tomorrow when I can actually see. I'm going to get up at the break of dawn um, to be able to take a, a walk around when, it, when it's, the lights come up. Um, so that's in like four hours, four hours from now. Um, hopefully she's not like injured. Ugh, there's fucking bugs everywhere. Um, hopefully she's not like injured or something, but she's been so flighty the last couple of days. And, and I get nervous about going to sleep while she's somewhere outside because... She is a little flighty. I mean, if she's just on, in the yard, I, I just didn't see her. And she can be bothered getting up to show me where she is, which is unusual. I mean, if she sees me walking around the yard, she normally gets up and chases after me. But say she, I just didn't see her, you know, and I go to sleep. And that's like four hours that she'll be outside. And she's like, been nervous for like, two or three days about being outside so um but she does have a hide she's got a cubby house and a large table she like that has uh, a cloth over it so that it's a like a, a hideout you know it's, it's a covered table so I guess she can hide in there she's really scared but but I'm, I'm so scared tonight. Like, I've got, like, pins and needles. So I hope nothing bad has happened to her. Because that might... Because I would just say, yeah, I've been so scared that tonight. And I don't know why. So hopefully nothing has happened to her. And I can be like, oh, so that, that might be why I feel scared. Maybe... I mean, if she hasn't run away from the property, she might have been bitten by, by a snake. And be injured on the property. A snake is the only thing that I can think of that could have be enough to injure her. Otherwise, I don't think she can be injured by much else. Um, but I didn't see her. Um, she might be in the bushes. If she was bitten by a snake, she might have just gotten into the bushes. Saying that she was roaming around the bushes today and she didn't get bitten by anything. So, um, so I don't know. But my best get, I, I do suspect though when I was notified, oh, has a dog, how's, how, how is the pet? Um, 
I think someone someone might have contacted her and say the dog's at their house so I'm I'm betting that I probably will find a hole I just didn't find it because it's really dark and I couldn't be bothered walking around everywhere I've walked around her usual dig spots but I didn't I didn't see anything like the, literally I saw nothing and so if she had dug she would if she would have dug around there somewhere so the only other places that she could have dug were the side the back of the sides which she never digs and the front which she sometimes digs up so but I'm, I'm really scared tonight I feel like I'm, I'm gonna find like a UFO or something like I've got trauma but I, like I said that might just be nerves because of God the dogs gone missing but I literally feel like I'm gonna like see a light and have a, like a robber approach the house or something. I'm like that nervous and it's scaring me. I'm just glad that this is the last night I'm gonna be on by myself because I'm literally terrified about something and I don't know what. I'm like looking at these windows and I'm like going, I just have to see a light. Across the road, there's Christmas lights shining. Um, so when I thought I saw her eyes earlier tonight, it could have just been like some of the lights that were shining across the road. Um, but I, I did think that I did see her eyes and she was traipsing over the yard. But I'm not sure. But I'm going to assume that I can't get to sleep tonight because there's bugs everywhere. So I'm going to keep the lights on maybe and then go to sleep and then wake up in a few hours i might change the time to 5 30 so that it'll, it'll definitely be light when i wake up but i don't think i'm gonna get to sleep anyways because there's too many bugs all over me and it's annoying me <laughs>